All right, we shall begin with NXT, WWE NXT, August 26th, 2020. The TakeOver uh, Aftermath show? Yeah, after, that's the word. TakeOver Aftermath show. So Karrion Cross and Scarlet come out. He is the new NXT champion. They do the full entrance. He's in a suit. He's raising up his belt. He's being Karrion Cross, but the whole time as he has the belt in one hand, his other hand, other arm is in a sling. He explains he told everyone so. He said he'd be champion and everyone would suffer. Said he'd pick the title from Keith Lee's carcass like flesh from the bones. But in any war, there's casualty on all sides. He has a separated shoulder. He actually likes fighting through the pain, but he knows they will not let him defend this title in his condition. In the path, there are obstacles. But for me, the obstacles are the path. And he puts the belt down. And we should mention they're in the performance center still. Uh, not doing Thunderdome for NXT. So the good thing about this is when they want Karrion Cross to come out and do an intense, quiet, almost whispering, almost whispering promo, they can just have everyone shut up. <laughs> it's dead quiet in there. And the moment he puts the belt down, there's soft booze. So he says, this change is nothing. Doomsday is still coming. In the end, everybody pays the toll. God help the obstacles that will be in my path. Tick tock. And at that point, Scarlet turns the hourglass over, and they just reboot him. <laughs> We're just, it's, it is what it is, and they're just going to do the same thing he's already done. Well, I didn't think about this when I watched this live, but I, I thought about it just now. So, I'm not sure if you people are aware of this or not, but Scarlet is incredibly beautiful. Mm. And Karrion Cross is a big, scary-looking badass. This show is also booked by Triple H, and coincidentally, 19 years ago, the show that we reviewed this week, Hunter went down with a quad tear. That's true. And he's gone, okay? Yes. When he suffered his injury, he was the top heel over yes. Stone Cold Steve Austin. Soon to be the top face. Okay? And he came back as a baby face. Yes, yes, ah, yes. So when I watched the show here tonight... And we had a big talk on Observer Live about this today, if you want to listen. Who the fuck are the top baby faces in NXT? Oh, nobody. The answer is the creep from the creep farm. He's, he's the also hurt. He's the closest thing we have to a top baby face. Because right. apparently undisputed are heels. Johnny Tomo Gargano's a heel. Tommaso Ciampa's a heel. Yes, Velveteen yes. Dream is a heel. Everybody in the main event next week in the four-way, they're all heels. <laughs> this is like, true. I the only baby faces on this show, like Swerve Scott is is not a main event baby face. He's a Drake Maverick is a jobber at this point. Please. Damian Priest is the secondary champion. There is no top baby face no. on NXT. Your other options are Breezango and Rhea Ripley. Well, frankly, would be Rhea Ripley but... is the top baby face, but I'm yes. talking on the male side. There yes. is no top male baby face. Yeah. So, it's going to be a while, but I'd bet you anything that Karrion Cross and Scarlet return as a super baby face top act. Hmm. They have to. Anything you <laughs> they, say. they got nobody. Yeah. The only problem is they're completely be gone for a couple of months, won't he? He's going to be gone for months, but like, yeah, when so he comes they, back... They, it's only like they can wait. <laughs> well, my <laughs> point is, the way Hunter has come back after he tore his quad, yes. I'm, I'm sure this guy's... Th this thing right here that they did, this was total babyface. This guy is a warrior. He went down in war, but he enjoys the pain, and he's yes. never going to give up, and here's nope. your belt, and I'll be back. It's fucking babyface from start to finish. Yes. So yeah, that's right. what I think is going to happen. That's entirely possible. And by God, they need some fucking babyface. Keith Lee's gone. Matt Riddle's gone. Yeah. Well, Every the, yeah. I, I want to say again, they need a baby face. Or they can't wait for Karrion Cross to come back and be that baby face. They need to set up a baby face really on Tuesday. If not in that four-way, then somewhere else on that show. So we have somebody to cheer for.